Did you know that there's a standards checker in AutoCAD that will allow you to check your drawings to make sure that they're all following a certain standard? I'm going to show you how to use it in this video. The standards checker will let you check for non-standard things like the incorrect units, incorrect layers, incorrect dimension, text styles, and so on. Before you can use the standards checker, you have to create a standards file. To do so, I'm going to open up this drawing that I've called architectural template, and it has all of the settings as if I would want as I would want for all of my drawings. And all I have to do is save this drawing as a standards file. So I'll go to the menu browser and I'll choose save as and then choose drawing standards. Once I do that, I'll browse to where I have that located so I want it to go in my DWS folder here it's going to be called architectural template .dws. I can choose save and now it's ready to go notice that it's changed the extension on this drawing here to DWS I don't need this open anymore so I'm simply going to close it now what I want to do is I want to run the standards checker in this drawing so I can just type in standards and it will launch the configure standards dialog box. The first thing that you want to do here is to load that DWS file that we just created. So I'll browse to that same place where I have my DWS file and I will select it and choose open and you can tell me it tells me now that here it is it's the architectural and this is the standards file and so on. If I check on the plugins these are the things it's going to check the dimension styles, the layers, the line types, multi-leader styles, and text styles. If I didn't want to check some or all of these, I could uncheck them or I can check them to say include them all. So I'm going to say include them all just to see what's going on here. If you choose the settings button, it comes up and it gives you a few notifications and some automatic stuff that you can check and, and set as, under, as, you, as you need fit. But now what I want to do is I want to say, let's go ahead and check those standards. Since this is a very small drawing, it just takes a couple seconds to go ahead and run that check. And what it does is it says, okay, here's some problems. For example, the dimension, dimension style or architectural, uh, there's some properties that are non-standard. And I want, what do you want to replace it with? It gives me some other choices. I'm going to say, let's replace it with that one. And then it lists those things that are non-standard, like uh, extension line extension, uh, text offset, all those kinds of things. And I'll just say fix. And so it goes through and it fixes all of those things that are incorrect in this new drawing. Likewise, with this one, it's saying, hey, there's something wrong with this layer A anno note. And it just so happens that the color is non-standard. So I'm going to say, OK, fix that as well. And you can go through and check. Now, sometimes on this one, for example, it says layer ANO border, the name is non-standard. So what I need to do is pick the actual name that it should be and choose fix. And you can do the same thing with that, so with, with the rest of them. So again, here's one that has the wall's name is incorrect. So I will just come down here and pick what it's supposed to be and fix. If I decide that I don't want to fix something, I can just choose next. So I'm just going to go through here and do next on the rest of these because there's quite a few mistakes in this drawing. And then at the end, it tells me this is the summary of everything that happened. Um, there were 12 problems found. None were fixed automatically, but four of them were fixed. So then we ignored you know, some other ones as well. And I can say, OK, close and then close. So that's how you can go through and ensure that your drawings are correct one at a time. However, there's also a batch standards checker. Let's say you have several drawings that you want to check. You can do that from the start menu. So I'll go to the start menu here and I'll go to AutoCAD. And then you'll see here that there's a batch standards checker that can come up here. Once it comes up, again, what I want to do on this tab now is I want to load the drawings that I want to check. So I'll say, OK, let's browse to where I want all of these to be checked. And I'm going to say Control Shift. End, and I'm just going to load all of those. OK, so it's going to check all of those drawings. Then I'm going to switch to the standards tab and I need to check the drawings against the following standards file. So I'll say let's go here and now here's where I will load that standards file. So I'll go to the 
same location where I had before and I'll find that standards file there it is right there open and then at this point again plugins I can say what are the things that I want to check and so on and then I can say okay let's go ahead and start the check it's gonna say oh I gotta save it first so it's gonna say where do I want to save it as I'm gonna just save this um, in my downloads folder just so that I know where it is save that and it goes through and it checks them all and then it launches in another window this one here and it gives you a list of all of the problems and each one of the drawings and all of the things that are listed in each one so it's more comprehensive you can look at all kinds of stuff and make sure that all of everybody in your company is following your standards and if not you can go through and fix it or tell them hey they need to go fix it so hope this was helpful and have a good day. Thank you.